Baruch Hashem, today is day number 103 of our daily study of Rambam Sefer Mitzvahs. And in the three chapters a day of Mishnah Torah, we are still in Hilchas Shechita, the laws of ritual slaughter, chapters 9, 10, and 11. And our mitzvah today is actually not about Shechita, it's not about ritual slaughter. But the Rambam deals with this mitzvah in the laws of ritual slaughter because it's sort of related. Um, and the mitzvah is shooing away the mother bird from the nest. So you see why it might be related to shechita. I mean, if you were creating a 14-volume compendium of all of the halachas, of all of Judaism, that pertain to all times and in all situations, where would you put the mitzvah of Shulah Chakan? That I'm going to put it with the laws of ritual slaughter. Now you're going to say, well, I don't know where to put it because I don't know what Shulah Chakan is. You didn't tell me yet. Okay, you're right. Fair enough. So let's do this. Negative commandment 306, the prohibition against taking the mother bird together with the children or the eggs. Somebody is out hunting. See why it's kind of related to shechita, to ritual slaughter. And um, he encounters a nest and he says, oh, I want to take those chicks or those eggs. But look, there's a mother bird there. So he has a prohibition. Do not take those little baby birds or eggs while the mother bird is still there. That is the prohibition. Now, is there any remedy for that? Is there anything you can do? to be able to take those uh, eggs or those baby birds if you want them? Why, yes, there is. And I can't tell you. <laughs> I could tell you, but I'm not going to tell you because then I would be spoiling tomorrow's mitzvah. So we'll see you again tomorrow for the continuation of this narrative. Okay, see you tomorrow, God willing.